I want to share a few tips and tricks to help you. So here I've hit a bunch of shots. I've hit five shots with my eight iron and five shots with my 52 degree wedge. So normally they're displayed like this, individual shots. But what you can do is click groups. So then it groups the, uh, the shots into the, uh, the correct club. So if I click 52 degree wedge here, I can see all five shots and I'm basically hitting it all over the club face. Um, but what's useful here is um, this stat over here. Well, actually a, a lot of these stats. So on average, I carry the 52 degree wedge 110 yards. So now I've got uh, a distance that I know and the side uh, stat over here. So on average, uh, this club, I my shots ended up right 25 feet 8 inches left of where I was aiming. And if I look at the 8 iron, so on average, right, carry 156.5 yards and ended up 35 feet 8 inches left of target. Uh, so that's roughly 12 yards or so. So I can actually take this stat with me to the golf course. So now I know that on the golf course, I probably want to aim a little bit right of the spot that I want to hit my ball to. Um, a few other things that you can do here. So up on top, tags. So let's say I want to do a uh, um, uh, wedge distance gapping. So you know, with my 52 degree wedge, I could have uh, two or three different swings, which will produce different distances. So like a little half swing or three quarter swing and a full swing. So what you can do is you can click uh, up here. So I'll go club, I'll select the 52 degree wedge, and then I'll click tags. So here I can basically type in uh, whatever I want to. So I can type in half swing, enter, and done. So see on the left hand side here, I have a separate category for 52 degree wedge with a half swing. And then I can continue to do this with a quarter swing or three quarter swing. So that way I have my wedges, my wedge distances all mapped out. So that's uh, very useful to have. And once you've done all that, so what you can do is on the bottom right hand corner here, click report and I can either select one club or I can select all. Click OK. So I can actually email this to myself and you'll get a link in your email. When you click that link, you will basically see exactly what we're seeing here. So you'll see all of the club data for the 8-iron, all of the club data for the 52-degree wedge, um, and you can click trajectory, optimizer. We didn't use the optimizer, so nothing here. Uh, club data, so you select the club, right? And you get the club data and video. So you will get all of the videos for all of the swings. So this is super useful to have. And uh, you just click share report contains 10 videos which are not uploaded yet. Would you like to upload? Yes. And uh, just click send. So now you will have a report in your email, uh, in your inbox, uh, with all of the swings uh, that you've made.